Yesterday, I went to the fun fair with my dad. It was very fun and I learned something new. Let me tell you all about it. We arrived at the fun fair and my favourite treat just appeared like magic right in front of me. Ice cream. I immediately put on my best convincing voice and said to my dad, please. Dad said, okay, but just a small one. Dad went to pay. He looked a bit shocked. How much? That has risen in price. He shook his head and paid the money. Then I saw my favorite game and decided that my convincing voice had to reappear. Please. Dad rolled his eyes, <laughs> but I knew he couldn't resist the convincing voice. <laughs> How much? I want a teddy. It was definitely my lucky day. It was about to get luckier, as I had spotted a balloon seller. Please. Dad looked at his wallet. It was almost empty, but luckily, the balloon seller said, We accept all major credit cards, sir. Of course you do, Dad exclaimed. Dad was a bit annoyed. He didn't have any money left. Then he said a very strange thing. I think your balloon isn't the only thing that's inflated. I was puzzled. What do you mean, Dad? Dad said, Well, when your balloon gets blown up, it is inflated. It gets bigger and bigger. When the price of items get bigger or increase, this is called inflation too. I asked, what sort of things? And Dad told me, everything. Food, toys, clothes, bike, you name it and the price of things change over time. I didn't know that. That sounds bad, I said to Dad. He said, sometimes it is. It can mean that things get more expensive and it's harder for some people to buy them. It's bad for those who can't buy and for those people who produce things. So if you make cars and the price of cars go up, not many people will be able to buy your car. Oh no, I exclaimed. So you lose your money. Dad said, not really. Your money loses value and the same amount of money will buy you less. If inflation is 7%, your money would be worth 7% less than it was before. For example, mom has a set budget to spend on grocery shopping every week. But if some items go up in price, she will get less items for her budget. I wondered why it happened. That explained that there were a few reasons why. It can be because more people want to buy things which can lead to businesses having a limited amount to sell. I thought, hmm, like when we were trying to buy my bike? Dad said, yes, I remember we had to try a few different types of bikes as the companies had risen their prices. I remember one of the bikes you liked only had 10 available and 100 people wanted them. Then the price increased as the business knew they could get more money. I asked, but does that mean only those people who have more money can afford it? Dad said, yes, that's right. He also said that the cost of making things can increase because the materials to make them may have also risen in cost. He gave me an example. My dad loves to tell a story example. Think of a loaf of bread. The price might rise because the flour to make it is more expensive. The gas to bake the bread and the fuel to transport the bread to the shops 
may have risen too. Ah, now I understood. But I had to ask the question. If the price of items are inflating, there's only one thing that hasn't. My dad said, what's that? And I replied, my pocket money. 